Hello, I'm Naomi Kitt. Here's a look at some of the top stories from 2 News Oklahoma. Three OU meteorology students died last night in a car wreck. 20-year-old Nicholas Nair, 19-year-old Gavin Short, and 22-year-old Drake Brooks were driving on I-35 in K County around 11.30 Friday night. Troopers say their car hydroplaned. It was then hit by a tractor trailer. All three young men were trapped inside for more than five hours. The other driver was taken to the hospital and released. The family of a Tulsa service member who was killed during a training exercise brought him back home today. It was a solemn afternoon at Tulsa International Airport where they met his body. Lieutenant junior grade Aaron Fowler grew up here in Tulsa. He graduated from the Naval Academy in 2018. Sadly, he died Easter Sunday during training in Hawaii. The organization Jack and Jill of America is hosting their national youth trip right here in Tulsa this weekend. Nearly 750 children and adults visited Tulsa's historic Greenwood District this morning. The group is from all over the country. They got a firsthand learning experience about the Tulsa Race Massacre and what Greenwood looked like both before and after the destruction. It's inspired songs and road trips for decades, and now Route 66 is celebrating a milestone. On this day 96 years ago, the name US 66 was proposed for a cross-country route connecting Chicago, Illinois to Santa Monica, California. The highway made cross-country travel affordable for many Americans and helped boost the economies of the cities it passed through. Your latest weather forecast, high temperatures into the 70s with morning lows into the 50s to right around 60 degrees. Quiet conditions through tomorrow on your Sunday with increasing clouds, skies becoming partly cloudy, but then showers and storms by early Monday morning and again by Monday night. And some of those storms could be strong to severe. A break on Tuesday, more activity midweek.